Welcome back to uh, k &L Farms. Uh, just a quick update. Uh, the excavator, uh, rented an excavator. It'll be here Friday, two days from today. And uh, I just wanted to go over some of the stuff real quickly. Uh, this was a leaning tree right here. That's all that's left of it. I just didn't have it, haven't moved it with the truck yet. And uh, I remember if you uh, like this content, uh, please hit the like button and the subscribe button. To, uh, and I'll show you real quickly what the purpose for the excavator is. These, remember, previous videos, these are, all these were standing trees. And if you look right, right there, you see a corner, rough corner. And right over here, you see a rough corner. And if you follow that line, this stump is on the line. This stump is on the line. And this is well within the building. So excavator, I've got to dig this stump out, which I'll show you on the video. This stump, this stump, and this stump's got to get out for sure. And uh, previous video, but I'll recap on it, is uh, so if you're doing an excavator, you're digging uh, a site out, you don't want it exactly the dimensions. You want it uh, five feet bigger so that you can commute around the perimeter of the forms and you can work that concrete. You just don't want the, uh, some, I'm gonna bring a, the concrete truck in from that way, probably, more than likely because the other way is clogged up, I can't use that anymore, so I gotta, I gotta skid a road with that excavator. But, uh, the, so, the other thing in that excavator is, I'll walk down here. This is the, this is the elevation of the new building. This is the, what it's going to be the elevation. That's pre-existing sewer that uh, is going to be poured and then my sewer for the new building will go into that. And then this is pre-existing, this is power. Power's right there, oh, telephone, and then there's a water line. Actually, there's a ground, ground cable right there. I can see the water line. And I believe the water line and uh, those utilities go up that hill that way. And this utility right here, this septic, this septic comes out of this pre-existing building, right about here, makes a 90, and it follows the path uh, I don't, of this this building. It went that way. That chicken coop over there is, is built on top of it. Uh, and you can see from here up to here, roughly, uh, roughly three feet, three feet of elevation change, which I have to remove in order to get the, in order to get this so that I can pour a flat grade you know, for the floor, which the floor will protrude from there to approximately right here. And uh, I just wanted to show you that for an update before I get the es excavator in uh, Friday. Uh, and the purpose for the purpose of the excavator, I can, I'll show you once I start digging. Once it gets delivered and I start digging with the excavator, uh, what this will look like after, but this is like a, a pre-shot, but uh, uh, that's all I had for today. Thank you. Have a good day.